So believe it or not, Swain and Broughton. She's making Swain and Broughton or Saw Broughton. I'll figure out which one. I think it's Swain and Broughton in the Philippines. Brooch. And Seriously, Klein and Brooch. <laughs> Sus, sweet. Uh huh. See you, baby. Video. <clears throat> so you're making swine broth? Yeah. Okay. So. They can put it on your thing. Oh. So, so this. <laughs> Filipina here is making. Now, see, she got to do that pose for the camera thing. That's automatic. Yeah. You know, when they start filming and they start posing. <clears throat> Get my good side. There it Look. is. The plant, the good side. <laughs> <laughs> this is four kilo brat. But I need the soy. Okay. Yeah. So. So, so, we have a lot of uh, different stuff here. And our makeshift kitchen here that it's uh, still a work in progress. <laughs> yep. yeah. There we go, I want to focus. Focus. So, they are working hard at this. There you have sisters together working on this swine at Rodney. With good old Filipino ingenuity. So, you're gonna put a little light on there, so, real quick. I don't know how others do it, but I, but I do it like this. You know? just like this is how I do it. <laughs> So you can cook it all on there. Right? So you're gonna cook it on the gas stove? Yeah. And she gonna cook this on the gas stove. See, I couldn't. So, I'll figure it out. And look, look, look. But we gotta oil. go back. We're missing oil. something. Antica, oil. So, oil. Good, good, good. Thank you. As the master chef. Kaya lang manipis yung kasalulan ni kaya masulat. Ano ba? Filipinos over there. Why do we have? Okay, we have three. We don't discriminate here. <laughs> but she is just one <clears throat> And her, a little German, but she's all Filipino. <laughs> yep. She's pretty much Filipino. <laughs> she got her own language too. Well, all babies. Yeah. Yeah. Say hi. Smile. Say hi. Oh yeah. Take a Smile. Yeah. Again. Again. Smile. Hi. 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 H
because you're a tante in Germany. Smile! 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 You're not a piquet! You're not a piquet! You're a piquet! Smile! 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 This is mustard. Back to the meat of the subject. <laughs> <laughs> this is mustard. Yes, they do have mustard in the Philippines in case anybody asks. <laughs> but it's a Philippine mustard that they like. The Heinz mustard is available it doesn't matter if it's important to have some, some mustard, mustard. Or a little mustard. There's some more of the of this oil. If you you spoil the meal if you ain't got no grease in it. So for all you healthy people, suck it up. <laughs> so. so then I will fry it. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm going to eat too much. What isn't it? Keto too? Oh. Keto diet. Keto yeah. diet? What is it? I don't so know. I just heard it. Uh, fry it a little bit. There's all kind of diet. Very, very, very healthy. Coffee diet. I'm doing the beer diet. Are you? Speaking of beer, we take a commercial break. Yeah, yeah. Speaking of beer, we take a commercial break for San Miguel. Oh, oh, oh. You can die. Some type of pills in there. Big pot. Big pot. Big pot. Big old pot. That'll be a good gumbo pot. That's something I like to make here. Some gumbo. If I had time, I would do it. Because people. Perfect here, everybody loves rice. So we would all get along well. Mm. You looking for mama? Where is where is mama? Where is mama? There is mama. Okay. Let me, let me get out of the way. Because the master chef. The stove <laughs> running. Put a little light on it. Frying already. So, so this is like a walk. Is this like a walk? Yeah, but this is a Philippine uh, rice pan. This is a Philippine, as you say, a Philippine it's, rice It's pan. a little bit too, it is a little too little, small. Yeah, for this big Yeah, this but I will move it back in here later. You know? Mm -hmm. So what I will do now... It's your show. I need to find a good spot. We'll stand right here so I get out of your way. And look at her. She all dressed up <laughs> in cooking. I keep telling her. Hey, don't we have some aprons here? Yeah, I do. You know. But I'm not used to doing that. So you're going to mess up a good shirt. You're going to get grease black. Oh, wow. She'll get grease on it, but I'll be the one buying her a new one, so she's not worried about messing it up. <laughs> See there? That's true. Baby, you're just going to buy me another one because I'm cooking. She's actually cooking this for me. So, see, I don't know what everybody else is going to eat. So, I really can't complain. I'll buy her two shirts, maybe, for cooking all that. I'll buy this for you, and you will eat this. 
with rice and the noodles. Oh, you know, we always gonna have okay. rice. May as well just do rice and skip the noodles. Because you know everybody just wants everybody just wants rice and not noodles. Well, we call it like a potato dumpling or potato balls. That's what Americans call it. Canoodle. We, we're not making that. We're not making that. See, this girl here around Heidelberg, they make their canoodles with bread. In Bavaria, we use taters, potatoes. Well, it actually is a lighter. And just let everybody know this kitchen is designed just to cook stuff outside, but so it's too hot in the house. And this is a big kitchen. Still um, under construction. We got a couple sinks, a little cooking area. It's a kitchen slash storage room now, but we haven't put it. So, we have here upo. Okay, we have vegetables. Upo. Kind of vegetables. Yeah. It is white squash. White, oh. white squash. Yeah, but yet, white you know, squash. Are you cooking that? Uh, I do my cook. Yes. <clears throat> and then I have palong. Palong. Eggplant. Eggplant. Palong. Well, you know? Different than ours are big and round, but in the Philippines they're long like that. Yes. Long and slim. And I got here. Everybody knows okra. that. Okra. Okra. Yes, they love okra in the Philippines. Okra. Actually, I learned how to cook okra from this girl, so it ain't so slimy. And she can make some hell of a fried chicken. I got to take her to Louisiana. <laughs> she can make Thank some fried you. chicken. Thank you, you would not believe. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. That's our little supervisor there. She controlling things, <laughs> making sure everybody paying attention. Oh, oh, there, yes, she, there she comes again, baby. Mama. That's the way it is in the Philippines. You got you got kids everywhere. Thank you. Now she's going to flip this monster. Here, you need some help or a big fork. Baby down, baby down. Yeah, get away. Very good. Flipping a big side of pork here. Wow. <laughs> It will not be time to let it be soft because I will not put it in the oven. I will just steam it. Only steaming. I know people may wonder, how would you cook a swine abroad if you ain't got an oven or something? But no, that's, that's what you call in Germany, small bracken. Swine, small bracken. But Filipinos got some ingenuity that you would not believe in how to cook without an oven. <laughs> and this girl here definitely can do it. We had a barbecue. Oh she made swine and Oh, was that sour broughton? Which one? Sour broughton you made? Sour broughton is your, it's yeah. like your, you put it in a mm. <laughs> well, She made, I had a barbecue. Onion. But I did a barbecue while I was barbecuing, you know, uh, ribs, pork steaks, whatever. And she made a swine and broth. Of course, Filipinos have never tried that. There's a huge hunk of beef like that. 
There was nothing left. I don't even think I taste any of it. <laughs> when we had that barbecue, oh, yeah, remember yeah. that uh, mom yeah. at the barn? Yeah. I don't think I got a piece of that at all. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't try none because I was barbecuing on the other side. Yeah. But we had a lot of food that was good and there was nothing left to take home. What's up, baby? No. No. Look, see there? This baby will tell you in a heartbeat what she don't like. <laughs> she got her own mind. See? She's like, nope. You only you can only videotape me for a short time and then that's it. After that you need to pay. <laughs> Okay, this is going to take a while, so just wanted to show you how you make wine and uh, sour. Wine and more broth. Wine and small broth. Where's the big top? So, the air is empty. I'm going to go get another one. Yeah, well. I'll put them in there. I'll put them in the freezer to cool down quicker. So. Oh, yeah. It ain't Filipino if you don't add a little soy sauce to it. Probably be some magic Surat too. Surat. She didn't have to do all that for me, but she said she wanted to make me something good to eat before I go back to the desert. I will transfer this very big piece of meat here. You buy nothing but this. Yeah, big pots. Yeah, because you have to like stir it up. Yeah, you have to stir it up. Yeah, big pots in the Philippines. Yeah, because you have to like steam. Because you never know who may show up. Yeah. Right? You know. She's Mama. like, get that camera out of my face. So. Bye y'all, thanks for watching. So, here's the results of letting it simmer in that wok. And it brown very beautifully. Now the magic chef here is preparing the second part. So what are you doing now, baby? Cook it there. Uh -huh. Okay. So she's got, this, she's got it ready to set in the magic sauce. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. She is working her magic. <laughs> so now I'm just cooking the. It will be. Uh, Cook in this gravy. And let it like simmer. Yeah, simmer. And uh, maybe for an hour. And see, she seasoned it, fried it in there. To me, I wouldn't have been able to do it, but see, she knows what she's doing. So, and that and will be put that. in that. Smells um, good. Yeah. And you can see it didn't cook some. 
still a bit red in the middle, but it once it simmers there, all that's going to be cooked all the way through. Very tender, juicy, and it's going to make some delicious sauce out of there. But you got to brown it first. Got all dressed up just to cook that. See? <laughs> Can you oh, believe that? No, nah, we were out shopping today, and she picked, decided at the last minute, picked up this big hunk of meat. <laughs> so I said, okay, I ain't gonna stop you. So this is like um, the meat is like um, cooked in water. $12 for that? Yeah, $12. Uh, it's not a bad price. Yeah, this is $12. That's a big hunk of meat for $12. So, now I will put it in the pot. pot. So. In, in the pot. Look. Here. In the sauce. Mm. And the other half. There too. Well, all swimming in the magic sauce. Yeah, just like that. Yes. Just like that. Yes. So, and then let us get the other in here. Look. Yes, and we will turn it down once it once it it boils. We will turn it down. Okay. Okay. Look, it's boiling. It's boiling. Oh, it's boiling. So we will turn it down a little bit. And see, I love her cooking here, cause she so. doesn't use the excessive excessive amount of salt <laughs> that so, some Filipinos love on their meat. So here <laughs> we will cover for like 30 minutes and we will check it out again. Oh, I forgot this. This has to be there too. The one bay leaf. Yeah. And the oh man, that one bay leaf is going to mess up everything. It needs to be in the pot. <laughs> I'll just do it like this. Ta da! This there we here. go. Oh, the juice. Yeah. It doesn't need get to be all, thrown away. Get a, you know, get all the taste in the pot. Yeah. All right. So. <clears throat> so, I'm going to help and wash the dishes. At least I could do my part since she did hers. So, I'm going to try to clean up some of the mess. Since my baby. Is missing the German food? No, I missed your food, whatever it is yeah. that you cook. Uh, I, I, that? I have something here that will, I mean, that is good to care that. Um, what, what is that? We just made rice with it. Rice and this. What is that? Knudel. It's the real German food. Uh, oh, you brought that with you, didn't yes, you? Yes, yes, for you, dear. Oh, man. Yes, for you. I told you I will cook this for you, dear. Look. Mm -hmm. I will cook this. I will put it here. And I put it like that. Yeah, because you, you got time. Yeah. Because that'll be ready so fast. Yeah. Just need lots of gravy. Yeah, and rice and so on. Oh yeah, okay. you got you got to have rice. Even if you're making pizza, you got to have rice. <laughs> oh, look at this! Wow. The battle is on. <laughs> All right, so let me help clean up, do my do my part. All right. All right. Thank you. You want it? Yep. So. You want to clean? 
Why not? Yep, I shall get right on it, master. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't have to, dear. I know. You don't Just want to help you out. So, bye, y'all. Dink. There she is. There's the end result. Two big hunks of meat. And canoodle. And pot full of sauce. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not bad. You did good. Yeah. Even though you're tired as can be. <laughs> Where is the um the dog in? Yeah. Shall I cut now? Or a little bit later? Well, you Might need to let it cool. Yeah, you need to let it cool yeah, before you yeah. cut it. That way it cuts better. All right. So you should let it sit for about, might be a little about 10 minutes. I'll try it. I'll wait a little too so much. It's good.